Hey peeps, it's Trish again. I did a major Christmas slash other shopping, but mostly Christmas U-Haul, um, not U-Haul, haul yesterday. So at Marshalls and Home Goods, so I'm gonna show you what I did. Okay, what I actually got. First, I got a Christmas gift for one of my little grand nieces. The little doll head rooted her hair. Her grandmother's a hairstylist. So I thought this, this was fitting. She is two years old and I think she'll like this. Let's see what do you guys think? That's my first one. Then I also got Marshalls and Home Goods. Tons of bags. Then I also got some toothbrushes. This is not for Christmas, but just to have extra toothbrushes. This I actually got from my son's girlfriend who sometimes stays over. And here's one, she needs a new one. This is a electrical one. I got this as an Marshalls, $6, good bargain. Here's another one. This is a wooden, this one is $2.99. Um, it's a organic toothbrush, eco-friendly, made out of bamboo and all that good stuff. Go. And oh, here's another one. Two of those. I always like to keep extra on hand just in case somebody stays over. Some new Christmas towels for the kitchen. Pretty pattern. One bag gone, 100 more to go. Then I also got this game. This is, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this myself or give it as a gift. Bag choices, choices. the have you ever party game. $13, $12.99. Okay, this is all from Marshalls. Then I got this for myself foot masks for my dry feet. Nasty. Go. Oof, another one for my feet. I call this a cheese grater. When I go to the spa, that's what I call it. For your calluses, $4.99. And then I got a pretty candle for me, a Christmas candle. Marshall's also. Smells wicked good. Like cookies, Christmas cookies. There. And I got some clothes. I got these, I mean, you use them as pajamas or you could use them as just loungers or you could go out with them. They're pants, Marshalls, a little drawstring. $9.99. These. Very comfy. Okay, I went through two bags already. Then I also have this is for my other grandniece. She is five. I think she's five right now. Or almost yeah, she's five. Um Actually, she's not five. She, she'll be five, I believe, in January. Um, she loves crafts and all that stuff. A wooden stamp kit, $7.99. Cute. And then I have, oh, I got myself a new 2021 calendar, $4.99. Hopefully I'll have more things to write in it for vacations. I need a vacation. And then I have some wrapping things for my grand, my niece having a baby girl, uh, Mia. Her name is gonna be Mia Rose Cibadel with Portuguese, so. And she, she's married a Portuguese dude, Luis, which I love. He's in the circle now. Um, 
Oh, this is a gift wrap for my mom for a blanket that she made her. A bag, and this is for, we're not really wrapping gifts now because of COVID, so this is just to decorate the ba basket that um, I put all her goodies in. There you go. Next weekend's her shower. And then I bought her, this is for Christmas though, for the ba new baby that's coming. Baby's due in January, January 17th. My birthday is January 18th, so maybe you'll, she'll be a, one day late for my birthday for teacher. She's birthday. Bought her this for Christmas, little, little bow and sock booties, $4.99. And I also got her this for Christmas so she could, her mommy could do her handprint or her daddy. <laughs> $4.99 also. I love these little like personalized ornaments for the first year. That's for Mia. Okay, the baby that's coming in January. Then I have also from Marsh, actually no, Home Goods, I think I have now. I'm on Home Goods. Almost a, it's the same company pretty much. I've got a decorative pillow. For Christmas for my couches. I'll be replacing those pumpkin pillows with some Christmas ones. Okay. Hold on, get more. Have another pillow. This will be for, for, probably for my office chair. Instead. Merry and bright. Home goods. Let's see. Sorry guys, I gotta go back here and get the rest of the packages. Then I got some decorative cookies, decorations. Um, some pine cones, golden pine cones to decorate somewhere. Actually, I might put these in my kitchen. Um, like a, not a vase, but a, a bowl that I have, Christmas bowl. So I need new ones. This is actually really cheap. $12.99 for a whole bag of them. And let me see. Hold on. Oops. Okay. More Christmas. And I got this little um, game for learning how to spell. Puzzles. Spell for one of my... This will probably be for my... I've got a lot of grand nieces and grand nephews. Well, not a lot, but... My nephew's kids, so I call them their grandnieces and nephews. This will probably probably be for um, a little, my grandnephew, Sebastian. It's He's two. And it's like puzzle pieces you put it together, rhyming, train, rain, car, star. Good for learning. And then I... Also have got some books. These are actually for the baby shower next week. Instead of giving cards, most people do um buy a book and you sign it. So that way you have tons of books collected for your new baby. Peekaboo. Um, Dr. Seuss book colors. Baby animal books with little feely things. I love these. These are really good for babies and toddlers because you could um, they could feel all the different textures. It has little textures. Cool. Okay. Then I got every year I get a new Christmas ornament depending on what's going on in our life. Um, this year I got this one because that reminded it's a glass ornament and um, that reminded me of um that to say COVID because it looks like the shape of the COVID inside. It's a snowflake, but it looks like the shape of the COVID. I'm probably I'm not sure if I'll put 2020 on it. We'll see. Maybe somewhere. But I'll remember. I always remember what ornaments are for what year because of what's going on and it's pretty cute. So you'll see that on my Christmas tree this year. Okay. Table's getting full. Then I also bought these. I don't know, these are um, knobs. I'm really into the stone and gemstones. So these are little 
knobs made of rose stone, um, which signifies love and yeah, love. I just bought these. I thought they were cute. Seven ninety nine. I don't know what I'm gonna use them for. I might put them. I'm not sure. I don't think I'm gonna use them as knobs. I'll probably use them as hooks somewhere. Probably in my office. I was thinking. I'll show them when I use show them to you when when I put them up. Next bag. Let's see here. I also got a new skirt for my Christmas tree. We usually, we usually, we have two Christmas trees. We have one that we use for all the colorful ornaments. It's all different colors. It, it's, I call it the kids tree, even though my kids are not kids or adults. And when they were little, we used to put them, we used to have a Christmas tree for the kids in the family room. And then we had our fancy tree which all gold and silver which i still for us that's our that was the adult christmas tree um pretty much all gold and silver and um glass ornaments and that was all white lights i'm looking at my cat and daisy they're playing but <laughs> um so we haven't put both of them and we used to have each kid had a little christmas tree in their room on the that they decorated with lights and all that um, obviously that we don't do that anymore in the rooms cause they're not little kids anymore. Um, so we have not put up both Christmas trees in a few years. Just, it's just such, so much work. I mean, I love it, but it's so much work taking it down, putting it up. I love putting it up and decorating it, but then taking it down. I hate taking it down. But, um, so this year I think I'm going to do, I'm going to do the gold and silver tree with the glass ornaments. Not sure. I might put the, the colorful Christmas tree up, which is the kids' Christmas tree with all their ornaments. They used to pick every used to pick every year when they were younger. They pick an ornament every year, and um, they make ornaments at school. So that that tree has all that stuff. But I bought a new Christmas skirt for the tree. It's like gray, shiny. I love it, love it, love it. And this was at Home Goods. And Christmas skirts aren't that cheap, but this one was pretty, actually was pretty cheap. Usually I pay like $50. This one was $29.99, so pretty good. Love it. Okay, and it goes with a pillow that I got like that. So that's awesome. Got that. Hold on, peace. So much stuff. And then... So excited. I got new runners because I use a runner, a table runner in my dining room and in my kitchen table. So I got two matching runners I'm going to replace. I have Christmas runners, but they're, I've had them for so many years, so they're getting very flimsy. So I bought two of these and they match this. Here's two of them. And I'm, they match the skirt. These, this one's a snowflake one. And this one's got little Christmas trees, but it's the same material, same idea, grays and whites, shiny. So one will be for the dining room, one will be for the kitchen. And it matches this Christmas skirt and the pillows. So it'll be awesome. Those go up. All right. Sorry, guys. I still have a couple more bags. I'm <laughs> Full of stuff on the table and the floor. Then I got some clothes for myself. And I'm probably going to wear this outfit out for the baby shower next week. And I'll show it to you after how it looks. I haven't tried it on yet. I hate trying on clothes in the dressing room at the stores. And plus, with COVID, I don't want to go do that. Um, but usually, I pretty good at the picking out sizes. This was on sale. It's a cute little shirt. $10.00. Um, Marshalls, cute, cute, burgundy. I love burgundies, and they look, they look actually really good on me, like the burgundy colors. I don't know why, because of my skin color, but they look good. I like them. So here's that. Then I bought pants to go with it, and they were $17. They're like more like they're pants, but leggings are stretchy. Love them, love them, love them. 
little pattern on them. Has like a little burgundy on them, like really, really pink. Only if you look up close, but they're, you could dress them up and down. They're pink, but more, they are like leggings also. So awesome. And I have like new boots. Due for new boots this year. I didn't buy, I haven't bought new boots in a couple years. So I bought, I ordered them some burgundy red boots, like knee high ones. Suede, so they should be coming in next week sometimes, probably another couple days. Uh, and then I bought this vest, which I absolutely love at Marshall's. And it's gonna go with that shirt and those pants. And it was $20, so it's a really nice vest. Let me see, here it goes. See? How cute, it's like a suede material right here. And then it's like fur, it's soft. And then in the back, I just liked it because it had a lot of textures. In the back, it's um, yarn. It's a, it's a sweater, I should say, sweater material in the back. And that's gonna go with those pants I just showed you and that burgundy shirt. That's gonna be in for next week and next Sunday's baby shower. And I also bought this shirt, it was $14.99. It's like a turtleneck kind of slinky little thing. You could wear with leggings too, cause it's really long. So it's really good. It's like a turtleneck. I'm actually do, I love, actually I love turtlenecks. And the ones I have are old, so and they're too high. So I bought these little lower ones that are in now. So I'm actually trying to buy more. This one's $15, so slinky. It's not like hot, long sleeves. And that could even go with that outfit too, it matches. Okay, one more bag. <laughs> All right, I found myself new slippers. Also, usually I buy slippers once a year. I get slippers for everyone at Christmas time. I put them in their stocking stuffers. But these are not going in my stocking stuffers, stuffers because I need new ones. Um, I threw a couple of them away where they were all raggedy and ready to be thrown out. This doesn't have a price on it, so I'm not even sure. I think it was $10, actually. Oh, no, $7.99. Little character slippers, very soft. Then I also got, oh my gosh, Daisy, she keeps barking. Little Mickey Mouse clips for my grandniece, um, Cameron. She's the one that I'm gonna give the hairdressing doll to. She is into Mickey Mouse. Last year I bought her some, I can't remember, something with Mickey Mouse. I can't remember what it was. But she has so many Mickey Mouse stuff. So I just saw these at Marshalls and I grabbed them, $4. For clips, she could use them for her chip clips, snack clips, or whatever she wants to use them for. Paper, put papers together, anything. And I got Daisy a gift for her stocking. Only one so far. A new Christmas doggy toy. Pretty pretty. And then I got some snacks. I got some chocolates. I think I have, an, I have another one too. Where did, where's the other one? I opened the other one yesterday because I was wanting some chocolates. I got mint ones too. So here's some. And some cookie stuff for my husband. He loves these. Marshalls also. And that's it. That's my whole haul. A lot actually. It was a big haul yesterday. It was crazy. I spent, I mean, it wasn't bad, but got a few Christmas things done for the kid, for the grand nieces and nephews. So that was good. I think I need a couple more things. Um, and that's it. Hope you are having a good weekend. See you next time.